Hello and welcome to another crappy review on something I don't know about. This is the 4.7's Mini AA. Guess who makes it? Yep, 4.7's. So I bought this flashlight uh, a while ago when I was doing some spending to make sure I had stuff that I wanted and I love this little flashlight. It is the coolest thing ever. I carry it around with me all the time. It's either in my bag or in my pocket because it's so tiny and it does a lot. It has 90 lumens out the front end in its maximum mode which I will show you later. It does 25 lumens in the medium mode and 2.7 7 lumens in the low mode. Now it'll do the low mode for 60 hours, which is a long time, or it'll do the high mode for 1.3 hours. And that is just with one AA battery. Um, it's super tiny. It's pretty cheap. It was $39, and for a really high quality flashlight, I think that's a bargain for sure something that you can use all the time. It's really, really small. I think I might have said that already. But, if you're looking to have a flashlight that's going to be easy to carry and really, really useful, I would definitely go with this flashlight. So, without further ado, I am going to turn the lights off and show you why I like this flashlight. That is my kitchen. You can tell it's super duper organized. I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the low mode. Somewhere. I can tighten it up. Boom. Low mode. And that'll last for 60 hours. I'm guessing with a normal AA battery. Here is the medium mode. Right there. Quite a bit brighter. Perfect for looking for a late night snack. Because you don't want to turn the light on and make it known that you like to eat late night snacks. High mode, right there. 90 lumens. It doesn't go very far, but it definitely floods the area pretty well. Helps you find whatever you need if you're looking for something in the dark, in a cupboard, possibly some more food. Low, medium, high. Low, medium, high, strobe. Yeah, don't look at that if you get seizures. And that is the SOS, I believe. And this is the high beacon. Oh yeah, it has extra modes. And that is going to be the low beacon. So it's got some extra modes if you're out camping or hunting. And you need an extra, like, backup flashlight. Then this might be a good flashlight for you because it's got some extra features. Um, I wish that it had a moment momentary on in the back um, so you could go through the uh, functions a little quicker. It's not really tactical at all. It's pretty much just for everyday uh, use. Anytime that you might need it, it's going to be there because it's small and you have it on you. So definitely, if you need a quick flashlight and you got a couple bucks, definitely buy this one. Also, it comes with a necklace type lanyard. Um, I use this all the time, actually. It's usually on here. I use it and just wrap it up when I put it away, put it in my pocket or whatever, but then you can carry it around your neck 
and just go on a walk or maybe if you're going on a hike and you just want to have it around your neck anytime you need to you will have a flashlight it's got a really good outside edge to it good rough surface so you can hold on to it I'm guessing that it is fairly waterproof I know that the 4 sevens lights are you know you pay for them and you spend a little money and you get a really high quality flashlight this came with a little rubber washer that I broke so chances are I messed that up and it's not going to be waterproof anymore but too bad I don't care because I'm probably not going to get it you know I'm not going to leave it in a pool um, but that could end up biting me in the butt one day I do need to get some better batteries. These ones are okay, but I want to get some lithium batteries just to give it some extended life. So thanks for watching, and I hope you find a good bad uh, or a good flashlight for yourself, and possibly make this one of them.